the pyramid above, the pyramid below. The words immediately following describes the deep hypnotic trance state that the elite of the world find themselves locked in. Far from being in control of an agenda for complete world domination, these elite religious, political and financial leaders are being manipulated from above, from a place they believe to be the domain of the gods. With arrogance as their guide, and devotion to the thought process of deceit, they fulfill the wishes and the agenda of an egregor group they know little to nothing of. The elite are not the top of the pyramid. Think of the pyramid as an hourglass, with two pyramids standing on their points, one above the other. This is why the hourglass is a sacred symbol to secret societies. The hourglass is the six-pointed star, the sex ritual symbol, prior to the sex act. When penetration occurs in the sex act, the hourglass triangles then overlap, and the regeneration process begins. This is symbolized by the sands of time pouring out of the top pyramid into the bottom pyramid. This in turn is the concept of as above, so below. This is what the double inverted pyramid at Belouva in Paris is all about. However, the elite of the world don't really comprehend this. At the top of the time pyramid, which is the lower pyramid, the Egregor has the elite of the world running around fulfilling the agenda of the Luciferian Egregor who are symbolized by the top pyramid. The 3D pyramid, the lower pyramid, looks up to the source of time, or father time, the pyramid above it, as being God. These elite leaders of the world have not the slightest clue that this is not a supreme god of the universe, neither that such a concept even exists. They believe this 3D system to be the product of a great god, who shows no mercy to anything or anyone that hinders the progress of building the kingdom of God on earth. This is their calling as well, and this, they believe, is reality. One aspect of the kingdom of God on earth includes the Day of Judgment and the Judgment of California, or the Judgment of L.A., Allah which judgment extends to the ends of the earth. For this reason they must seek out every opportunity, to further the bloodshed, the pursuit of power, wealth and unending fear, or they feel the sense of being a bad steward and an unworthy servant of the Lord. Because the trance state is so ingrained, so deeply rooted within their illusory life experience, they can't even begin to comprehend what's written here, or what it is that's transpiring in the 3D realm. The elite are all compartmentalized, and even more so than the average man. The reason for this is that they don't believe they're boxed in or limited in scope and influence. It's like a blind man who's never seen the light of day, attempting to describe the beauty of the woman. They can rattle on about the things that inspire them about what that beauty must entail, but they really don't know what it is, for they've never seen it, and are only going on whatever is implanted within their subconscious mind. Each one of these elite minds only gets a bit of what it is that they need to know to move the agenda along. The elite of the world are the most manipulated of all. The 3D thought process is unrelenting and what is right on this side is totally beyond their comprehension. There are none so blind as those who don't know they're blind. For this reason, the elite seem to have a matrix in their control. A matrix that's being manipulated by the Illuminati families of the world. A network of individuals working out a secret agenda that never seems to blow ITS cover, that stays hidden, and only reveals what it is they want the common folk to know. In reality. The elite of the world are a massive band of stooges who have no fucking clue what's going on, and those seeming to gain access to the Illuminati agenda are only acting as messengers for the Luciferian elite who reside in the inverted top pyramid, the Sacrifice B pyramid, which is the mother, the woman, the queen of heaven pyramid. Everyone is being manipulated, and everyone is the product of this manipulation, which is the thought process. The thought process is the manipulation of reality and the initiation of the concepts of time and space both of which are not real, both of which the elite of the world insist are real.